what's up people so i kind of uh stumbled onto something or something that i've been thinking about for a while and uh the thought that i've that i've had is okay so when you have thoughts it's an electrical signal like an impulse in your brain so i was thinking okay whatever you can use rfid blocking fabric which works and it, it works but it's not perf perfect or it's not perfected so what you can do is you can use different like different types of materials so what i've pretty much kind of stumbled on is um so this website here so it's called magcraft or something so anyways it just pretty much tells you what's conductive and what's not conductive so what i've been thinking is like the whole reason that they're able to freaking you know read our thoughts in the first place is because it's an electrical signal that they're picking up so um if you can find something that blocks something of electrical signal it would probably be a benefit right now i'm using a couple of these that are not conductive but look and you want to make things that are non-conductive plus things that block emf and rf waves elf waves whatever fabric that you can find that can go with it so and that would be like rfid blocking fabric so i'm gonna put the link in the description so type type of random uh, okay so this is a uh, conductors and insulators so these are the conductors the ones that electricity can pass through so which would help them to read your thoughts and track you properly so like i've told these perps before and i have them flying outside my window and stuff like that and like cops passing by like every time i figure something out and it's just like it's it's lame it's it's not even a factor the the factor is that i keep saying the more that they target me the more smarter i get so these probably you're not going to want to use any of these conductors because what they do is they focus electricity at your head which helps them to read your brain frequencies so they could put on their stupid little sirens all they want all right so these are insulators glass rubber oil asphalt fiberglass porcelain ceramic quartz dry cotton dry paper dry wood i i do want to try the wood i want to put a few of these together my um like my ultimate kind of build would be like a thin layer of wood um a carbon fiber and uh maybe some rubber that would be like um good and then also like the rfid blocking fabric like on top or whatever and you can put it in any order that you think would be the most effective so i just kind of like kept thinking about stuff and it just makes sense so right now i'm using um I'm using a package that I had got in the mail and it had, uh, you see how it says air? So there's a package that I got in the mail and you know how it comes with like bubble inside of the package to keep whatever item from being damaged. Well, it has air bubbles in it plus it has paper. So that's two things that you can use that um, are beneficial. So... I have rubber right now. I have dry paper and not pure water, but I have water, which you should probably get purified water. Um, so I'm going to show you guys um, what kind of rubber material you can use. And uh, 
Oh, that's cool. Quartz crystals, I guess. Let's... And I hope I'm right about the like conductors and insulators. I I think I am I'm not sure, but see how all conductors it says aluminum. Well, I've been using aluminum, and what it is is when you use aluminum and magnets, it's a conductor, so it amplifies the electromagnetic frequency and to a really uh, large scale. Or these perps are just like kind of bent out of shape about it because they can't get a good reading on you. And uh, it's pretty fun sight to see when you uh, when you mess with them like that. So put a good four layers of aluminum and a big old magnet that can attach to the little metal thing in your hat, and uh, you'll see them running around like a freaking uh, like two dogs stuck to each other. Um, so like I just I, I love that I had just looked this up right after the videos, and like whenever they pass and they try to feel like they're they have the upper hand. I always just backhand them in the face and just make them look like um, the giant fuck tarts that they are. So it's just like praise Yeshua. A fiberglass. I do really want to try that because I have a fiberglass um, RFID blocking wallet and it works really well. And I just put that wallet like in the back of my hat. I, I clipped it on. And they started having problems just with me clipping that thing on. So imagine you had like something that was oval or a thin layer of it that you can add with different different layers of, of different materials. And uh, I mean, if one material works better than the other, I mean, just just why not use one, just that one material and see how it works, you know, um, and you don't really need the others. So I just try to add other materials because, you know, it's just better because it, it they have to focus more different energies at you. Because if you just have paper, then they'll focus one energy at you. If you have paper, air, plastic, freaking rubber, all this crap, they're going to have to have like 10 satellites on you at one time. Because everything has its purpose. When you use earplugs, um, your mind is more sharp. So when a... Um, ambulance passes they're able to read your frequency better so you don't actually want to wear earplugs when you're out and about unless they're fidelity uh earplugs um but when you go to sleep you want to wear the ones that um Uh, that can block noise because what they do is they focus frequencies on you when you're asleep to change your brain uh, chemistry or uh, frequency or whatever and uh, so that's the thing you want to avoid and these are things that I just kind of caught on to because when I would use magnets I would roll up my windows and what they would do is they would have scooters at the corners and what the car would do when you have rear windows rolled up is it caused like a suction of air to be trapped in there and that they were able to scan you and for some reason when I had my windows rolled down and I would have magnets with aluminum or whatever the case may be um, they weren't able to get an accurate reading on me for some reason so um, I just went out and I was using some different materials some new materials that um, one of them was conductive and I kind of just thought about it and I'm just like, you don't want something that's conductive because it's going to help them to, to track you and to read pretty much brain, uh, brain map you. So you don't want that. And, uh, you know, I'm just pretty much, um, like uh, pimp slapping them right now because I actually know what I'm talking about and they don't like it very much, but they can't do shit about it, but just, uh, sit back and watch me beat them. So it's just, it's it's very enjoyable on my part because I know there's just a shit ton of people like looking and anticipating my my moves and like they think they have the upper hand. But I all I need to do really is just like give it some thought, trust in the most high and like it'll easily be done. Like I don't even have to lift the pinky. And this is how crazy it is because um, we make it so hard. Um, but all we need, really need to do is think of how our body works and then we can figure it out from there. So, um, I love it. And, uh, here comes the little lame ass helicopter.
uh, I think they're tr they're they're kind of butthurt right now because of what I said. And they usually come whenever I talk crap, so it's just like it's already normal to me and shit. I kind of enjoy it though because it like makes me feel special in kind of a way. So they're wasting like how much of fuel every day just to like stay hovering by my house. <laughs> oh shit. So I'm going to put this link in the description. There's a lot of informative information about magnets, about electricity, about, you know, conductive energy and all kinds of different things that's really informative and can help you even come up with even something that's better than my solution or, uh, you know, temporary fix. Um, so you want to probably get Fidelity earphones. I think they're the best ones that I found. They're called... Uh, I forgot the name. I'll just look them up right now. I've done this on uh, on another video, but uh, I'll do it again. So I'm going to show you guys the rubber that I use and then the earphones that uh, I recommend to you guys. So eventually, like, I'll perfect whatever I'm using, and that'll just get better over time. Uh, all I kind of need is a little bit of money to, like, invest in these materials. I do have my PayPal link to my account if you go on about, and if you guys ever wanted to donate, you can, but I'm not asking for any handouts. Whatever money you guys give me, it's going to go towards the cause of messing up this per program, so just know that. So these are the ones, Vibes. These are the ones that I recommend. These you can sleep with, you can wear outside, and uh, your brain isn't going to be focused because you can still hear. So um, it's not going to be easier for them to read your brain frequency. Because at the state your brain is is in, if you, if you wear like uh, silicone earplugs, those are better for just sleeping. If you try to wear them like outside, they'll they'll use it to their advantage. They focus certain energy on you, and it just gives them an accurate, re more accurate reading of your brain frequency. So, I just learned that right now. So these are really good, and then. My phone, my phone's been really slow for some reason. Um, I think the government's ass is a little bit chapped, and they're like kind of slowing my phone down. But I mean, it doesn't really matter. So what you're going to want to get is like a reusable tap for a car and it's made out of rubber. So something like those. I forgot which one I used. Um, just look for the one that's, I mean, probably the one that I got isn't even that good. But uh, try to look for one that's rubber because on the list it says rubber and water. Is a good thing at 
blocking uh, electric current. So you want to stop those brain frequencies from being read. It's your main key. I'm not sure if you should also wet the towel. Um, you can try it. But I suggest just try it without the water first. And then if you're still getting hit with like any type of stuff, try to add water to it. And uh, it should make it more effective. So I don't know why the pictures are not coming out for some reason, but uh, Robert, uh, I don't know why the heck this thing is coming out. Anyways, oh, my phone's acting up. This one's the one I ordered, the natural single absorber. I'm not sure if it's uh, rubber though, but we'll, we'll look at the uh, details right now. I mean, you can probably find a better choice, like if you can. First, whatever I recommend to you, you should always just look if you can find something better. And hopefully you can tell me, but I usually look first. And then these are the ones that I end up choosing because they just, I guess they seem the best at the time. But I mean, there's always new stuff and you can find some better stuff. So just keep an eye out. Man, my phone is jacking up. Sure. Um, this is the one that I bought, but it's kind of big. You have to kind of cut it in half because... The whole thing can fit in the hat, but it's going to take up a lot of room. Spend less time drying more at time. Has anyone seen if it said rubber? Because I can't even, I haven't seen anything.
Or you're gonna want at least one that has like some rubber in it or you know if you can find one that has description okay here we go only one of those are superior tech I've just, <clears throat> honestly, I've just used this by itself. Absorbed, absorbed water just by itself. And uh, I threw off these perps, so it does work. I don't know if it's, if you want to find one with rubber, you can. I suggest to find one with rubber. That's your best bet. So I hope you guys found this interesting because I sure do. And, uh. I can't wait to perfect a technique that's going to put all these perps on their ass. Praise Yeshua.